I've come to Wiltshire where David Butler is cutting oilseed rape today. I've come along to find out how yields and quality are looking. Well, I think there's a lot, lot of reasons to be cheerful. The weather's been very cooperative this year, uh, so we've had a, a fairly good run through with, with few a uh, few stop periods. Um, the moistures have been uh, just about right, so we've been getting the oilseed rape in between 8 and, and, and 10%. Which is just what we're looking for. We have uh, up to our rape acreage and we've got about 600 acres of rape to do and we've done just over half of that at the moment. Yields have been underwhelming and quite varied between different varieties. In tons of the acre we've seen as low as around one on one field um, and probably about as high as a tonne and a half to the acre so a slightly disappointing picture on the yields but on the plus side as I say there's been lower costs in terms of actually the harvesting operation. Winter barley, um, a similar picture with uh, quite varied uh, yield. Overall, I don't know what we did differently, but our bushel weights actually were, were pretty respectable on our winter barley. Our yields were um, on the feed barley, which was uh, mostly cassia, uh, were disappointing to, to us. So they were somewhere around 2.7, 2.8 tonnes to the acre. We were hoping for a bit more than that. Um, but our bushel weights were, were in the high 60s, and I don't know what, what, how we achieved that when a lot of people have reported low bushel weights this year. But we haven't started the wheat. I've been quite concerned at the, the levels of ear disease you can see in the wheat. Um, so I'm, I'm fearful for, for the yields and the quality and rubbing out a few ears of our Crusoe, which we consider our most important wheat, um, there looks to be quite a few pinched grains. So I suspect the wheat will continue the trend of underwhelming yields. Um, but as I say, there's a lot to be positive, positive about. If the weather cooperates and we can get it in a hassle-free harvest, then I'll, uh, I'll still, be, still be smiling. And the prices, the prices are considerably better than, than we were seeing this time last year. So there, there, there is um, things to be encouraged about.